Wanna find out how your ministers in charge of finance and economy, Patrick Chinamasa and Mike Bima, performed in 2018? In a few moments, I will reveal you the real truth, so pay close attention. We will analyze only the single most important metric to determine how successful ministers were in particular year. Here's the deal. Most important metric for economy is GDP per capita based on PPP. It's gross domestic product converted to international dollars using purchasing power parity rates and divided by total population. Basically, it's number that tells you how much stuff can every citizen buy with wage he gets every month. In countries with higher numbers, citizens live great and buy a bunch of new things every month. In countries with low numbers, citizens live bad and scrape every month to buy food and pay living expenses just to survive. If you are from Zimbabwe, comment below how much could you afford in 2018 and were you satisfied with that? Now, our data source will be IMF's GDP per capita based on PPP rankings report. IMF stands for International Monetary Fund. We will analyze two main factors. Position in 2018 GDP per capita based on PPP rankings and change in rankings. Based on those factors, all ministers get grades. Grades are Phenomenal, which is the best, amazing, excellent, great, good, then fair, which is neutral, mediocre, poor, bad, awful, and abysmal, which is the worst. If country dropped ranking from last year, ministers can get positive grade. Is that clear? And now are you ready? Zimbabwe ministers in charge of finance and economy Patrick Chinamasa and Mike Bima in 2018 performed Drumroll, wait for it, mediocre. You can best visualize it by seeing how high this red arrow is. And now few numbers. Their score was 390 and they ranked 116th among all economy related ministers. Zimbabwe was ranked 162nd in 2017, which is very low. And in 2018, they kept their 162nd place. So as you can see, it's a mediocre job. If you now want to see how leader of Zimbabwe, President Emerson Mnangagwa, performed in 2018, click the link in the top right corner. And that's not all. Let's see a few ministers related to economy that performed the best, so you can see how phenomenal performance looks like. Here is the top of the rankings. Ranked number number one were ministers from Taiwan, Su Jin Rong and Shen Jong Chin. They did phenomenal job and Taiwan recorded jump of three places in the ranking. Rank number two were ministers from Spain, Maria Jesus Montero and Nadia Calvino. Phenomenal job. Spain also jumped three places in the rankings. Rank number three were ministers from China, Liu Kun and Zhong Shan. And although China ranks a little bit lower than Taiwan and Spain, in 2018 they leaped four places from 81st to 77th. Now, before you go and watch next video, remember to subscribe and click bell icon so you don't miss new 2019 rankings. I will analyze 2019 performance as soon as new IMF ratings become available. Bye!